JCX here, and welcome to Siren Head, The Awakening. I know I'm a bit behind on the Siren Head stuff, but this is the first chance I've had to sit down and actually find a game that looked good and uh, that I wanted to play. If you're not familiar with Siren Head, super cool lore, kind of plays like Slender. I'm very excited to get in and play this game. I've been looking for something to really scare me. The intro at this game when it launches says, Do not play this game if you have heart problems. It is not for the faint of heart, or have had a history of heart problems. It is not for the faint of heart. Very excited to play. Um, as always, I will leave a link to the game down in the description below. You guys can feel free to comment. Tell me what your favorite part of the video is. I love reading your comments. I love interacting with the community and just hearing thoughts about the videos, what you liked, what you didn't like, what your favorite part of the videos were, and so forth and so forth. So, that being said, as you can see, only a few of you somewhere up here are subscribed to the channel. If you like my videos and want to help continue to support me, Please feel free to subscribe. It's free and you can always unsubscribe later. Hopefully you don't, but you always can. And without further ado, let's get into Siren Head Awakening. Uh, we'll do barely invisible. Continue. Oh, you could change your background too. We're going to do winter. I love the sound of crunchy snow in horror games. The original experience, normal Siren Head to difficulty, Siren Head spawns after first item, limited stamina. Easy experience, hardcore experience. Harder Siren Head, difficulty Siren Head is active from the start, flashlight uses batteries, limited stamina. Alright, we're gonna do the original. If you guys want to see me do a hardcore run, let me know in the comments below and we will do a hardcore. Normally I would dive right in, but I've never played a Siren Head game before, so I want to check it out. Prisma Game presents... Siren Head Awakening. Dun dun dun! Are you ready? I'm ready. Friday, March 21st, 1997. Gas canister, spark plug, oil canister, car battery. Welcome to Siren Head Awakening. You find yourself in the middle of a dark forest with nothing but a flashlight. You must find four car parts scattered across the map to repair your broken down car and escape. Due to physical limitations, you can only hold one car part at a time. Oh, okay. Finding car parts among other items also seems to anger the beast that lurks the shadows. Siren Head. So, it is just exactly like Slenderman. Um, the more pages you find... In Slenderman, the more active and aggressive he becomes. The more things you find in this game, the more aggressive Siren Head becomes. Stamina is an important part of your life when sprinting through the woods. You're very vulnerable without it, use it, so use it wisely. Your flashlight is also a valuable tool, but be sure to turn it off when you hear Siren Head nearby or else you'll get hunted. When being hunted, it is a good idea to try and find shelter while running away. Siren Head cannot reach you for, cannot reach for you if you're inside a building or a vehicle. Use whatever you learn to try to escape. Good luck. Man, he's just... It is just a weird-looking creature. Oh, God. Can I turn my sensitivity up at all? That's better. Oh, God. I have to come back here every time. Ugh. We could jump. I don't know if I'm supposed to go through the woods. Or if I'm just supposed to stay on the path. Oh, there's a path right here. It leads off. I wonder if noise attracts him. Uh... 
for little car parts. All right, so it looks like it just goes all the way around. <coughs> I could hope. That's what I gathered from that. So we're just going to run and find the first item. He shouldn't be a problem until I start collecting things and stuff. The bus, the ambience. I can't even use the stars for like directional sense because they all get mixed up. Got my head on a swivel. I'm ready. We got anything in here? Nothing. Oh, I can hide in here though. Interesting. Is that my car? Nothing in the trash. That's a gas can that I need? Yep. Now we go back to the car. Just take me back to the car. Hopefully this takes me back to the car. Oh, there are power lines I can follow, too. Interesting. I almost thought I heard somebody. This did not take me back to my car. Shite. Now, I know my car is over this way through the woods somewhere. There's the bus stop. There's my car. Okay. That's good to know. I wonder if it's when you add the item or when you pick up the item. Either way, that is dreadful. What do you mean I can't hide in these houses? How am I supposed to hide? From the old big bad man. Is that my car right there? No, that's just another broken down car. But my car is over there. Oh god! Oh god! I saw him. I can't see shit. I see a goddamn thing. Go away, go away, go away. Oh man. He was right there, too. Shite! I need to get over there. I cannot see anything other than the path in front of me. We're gonna play this game in the dark now. That's it. This is just a dark game. Because he is... Terrifying. I don't like that at all. Hopefully he can't teleport. Like, to be over here like Slenderman can. You could run direct opposite to- He can teleport! No, 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 no. God, that is unsettling. Ah! 
That's not fair that he can teleport. Unless there's more than one. Which I doubt, but... The game would be called Siren Heads at that point if there was more than one. I need a car part. One. Oh god, I could hide in here, I suppose. If I had to. That is not fair at all that he can do that. for me to hide in. No, 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 no. You can hear it get to you fainter. Yeah, you big jerk. I was in the danger zone on that one, chat. You know what? Oh, he's right there. Oh my god. Y'all see that? Holy! Right, well, we know he's the other way now. Good lord. That is terrifying. It's the first bus I hit in. That's the car I went to. Another train car. Are there parts in here? Yeah, there's the battery. Oh, now I gotta go all the way back there. Darn it. We're just gonna make a straight run for it through the trees and hope I don't run into him. Oh, there's a gas station back here, too. Cool. Bet I find a part there. If you get lucky, you can kind of see him on the silhouettes of the trees. Told you I'd find one. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Get to the car. He was off to my right. Did you hear the dump stompies? I think he was off to my left. I just heard stomping again. The 
last place I want to be is out in the middle of the woods. Is that... God. That's exactly why I didn't want to be out in the middle of the woods. What is this? Yes! Oh my god. Go, 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 go. We out of here. Oh, I'm in the red. If he strikes now, I am doomed. Play this smart, play this smart. My car should be right over here. There it is. We out of here, chat. Let's go. We out. That's it. That is it. Trouble came with collecting your car parts. The terror filled in your heart throughout the journey. You've managed to repair the car, ready for escape. But the loud, booming footsteps seem ever closer than before. You've never been so terrified in your life. Graciously made the escape, never to return again. You live to tell the tale. You escaped alive. Go us. There were once people who explored the map before you. Find the notes they've left behind. Interesting. So, that was Siren Head The Awakening. If you guys like this, make sure to hit the like video and play the game for yourselves. I will leave the description or leave the link to the game, excuse me, in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content like this and other videos that I've done. And I will see you all in the next video. Until then. Bye, everyone. Let's go.